Is there anybody? Is there anybody in there right now? You can call. Yeah. Who? It's called Tom here. Tom, did he open up your video? No. He didn't. Well, has he looked at any houses lately? Doesn't look like it. These are some old ones that need some follow up from a while. Well, well, okay. If he's not looking, just say you're in our system. I was just calling to ask you a few questions. Going to have thirty seconds of your time. And then what you're really trying to discover is, has he already bought a house, or is that is there any way he would consider it in the near future? Let's see. Put him on the speaker. He is. Hi, Rabbit. Hi, Rabbit. Over there. Hello. Hey, Tom. This is Drew with Zillow Premier and the Good Time Tommy team. How are you doing today? I'm doing fantastic. Thank you for asking. Hey, Tom, I know I probably caught you off guard, but uh, I was going through my database and you came in through Zillow a couple months ago. And I just want to see if I can get about 30 seconds of your time. Is that okay with you? Oh, absolutely. Well, hey, man, congratulations. Did he hang up on you? He's already bought. Now, see, we already put in our system in your notes. Dude's already bought. That's what I just did. Already put it in there. Already bought a home. <laughs> I'd like to know. I know they said that. I'd like to know. Hey, what did, if you don't mind me asking, when did you buy? We just like to know how we missed you. And did you already have a realtor? That's what I was planning on asking. Yeah, he well, I mean, it did sound like he was busy. <laughs> Plus he was faking them phone calls, but I'd say he was busy. Who are you calling next? Tabby. Tabby, Tabby, Tabby. Now look, you could probably, if you were to make a hundred phone calls today, how many people would even answer? Hopefully 10 to 15, if I'm lucky. Would that many would answer? I would say if I made a hundred. Hey, is this Tabby? Hey, Tabby, this is Drew with Zillow Premier and the Good Time Tommy team. How are you doing today? I'm doing fantastic. Thank you for asking. Hey, I know I probably caught you off guard, but the purpose for my call is I received your information through our Zillow platform. I just wanted to reach out to you and see if I can get about 30 seconds of your time. Hey, well, thank you so much, Tabby. I appreciate that. So like I said, you came in through our Zillow platform a few months ago. I just wanted to see if you're still in the market for a home or if you've already bought a home. Okay, I got you. I got you. Well, absolutely. And most of the time, whenever people do come in through Zillow, they're anywhere from a day out to two years from buying a home. If you, let's just say, if you had a magic wand and you found the perfect home within the next year, would you even consider buying? What is absolutely? Hold on. So, you know. What what is holding you up from stopping a bind right now? Oh, well, I just, I just got settled really. Yes, ma'am. Did she just make it? Okay. I got you. Did you just now move to the area, or are you from the Murfreesboro area? No, I moved from Florida to Murfreesboro in March. How do you like okay. it? I got you. Well, how do you like the area so far? Well, that's awesome. Well, so, look, in the, if, well, she, if she's going to buy in the upcoming if, year, if you, what kind of house would you If you were going to buy us? in the upcoming year, what is, what is something that you would have to have in your next home? Something that would really you're get start your side? Because I, I can get you set up on an email campaign and get you some homes sent to you. Okay. Um, well, I really want one leg. Better be writing notes. Absolutely, we can. Yes, ma'am. Well, perfect. What's the price? And if you could ask her if she'd want your help to make this happen. Three bedrooms. Okay. And in your mind, what would be a perfect, you know, monthly payment or price you would like to stay around?
250. Is that the price or monthly payment? Absolutely. Is that, and you're talking about price, correct? Yes, ma'am. Okay, absolutely. Well, you know, I, I do know you did say you could be about a year out, but, uh, you know, if you found something you really fell in love with today, would it even be a consideration for you? Didn't push it. What you need to do is if you could help her through this year, would she have a problem using you to do this? Yes, ma'am. Absolutely. Absolutely. Well, also. Absolutely. Well, here's here's what I'll do for you, Miss Tabby. I'll get some homes sent to you that are within, you know, all the the things that you said you need in a home. And if you found the perfect thing, would you consider using me to help you make that purchase? Absolutely. Well, say, so well, again, I'm Drew. Well, well, once again, I'm Drew. I'm with Zillow Premier and John Jones. Tell her you're going to email or accept email. And I'm going to get some emails sent to you right now. Let me just confirm. Is tabbygg.b at gmail.com a good email for you? Absolutely. I, I'm, I'm going to get some homes sent to you right now. Do you have any questions about the process? That, uh, She's got to you? accept you, I think. Or does she not? Okay. Yes, ma'am. Well, another thing I'll do, I did, I did get your information through Zillow, so would you, would you be okay if I sent you my agent invitation on Zillow just so I can send, send you some more homes on there, too? Because I know people like... I'm going to send you a link to our website as well, but I know a lot of people still look on Zillow, so would that be okay with you? Yes, sir. That's fine. Well, perfect. Well, Miss Tabby, I'm going to get you taken care of. And if you again, have, I'm Drew. And I'm, I'm Drew again, and if you have any questions at all, you now have my cell phone number, so don't hesitate to give me a call or text. Does that sound good? Okay. Thank you so much. Yes, ma'am. No problem at all. Hey, I appreciate you giving me, giving me some of your time. You too. Have a good day. No, no. Look, that's a damn. Most people aren't going to be near that nice, but you yeah. did good. But whatever you've got, these people and they're giving you information. Dig deeper. Keep digging. So what you should have really found out there's something. There's really something right now that's making her say we're a year out. There's something. It's credit. It's job. There's something that's holding her back from doing that. So you need to ask, you need to probe, you need to pry, you need to get this out. And you did good whenever you're asking, look, if I can do all this for you, if I can help make this happen, would you have any problem using me? So now what you've got to do is you've got to follow up. So you need to go back in there. You need to send her something. I would text her again, make sure she starts opening up the emails. It's all a game of follow-up, but that was a good call. But most of them, if, you're, if, you're, if anybody watches this, that was like a damn easy call. That they, was. They're usually not near that that <laughs> nice. But the reason why she was that nice is because she's she's not threatened. If people are like threat like ready to buy right now, they're a lot more they're a lot more nervous about giving away information and pressure. Hey, good job, kid.